Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to install EA app completely. With completely, I mean literally completely. To delete it, remove the files and remove everything that you have in mind. So first of all, what you have to do is to go ahead and go to your EA files and make sure that your subscription is actually off. Because once you are deleting it, that means that you're not willing to pay or we're not willing to get anything. So in that case, in case you had Game Pass only for FIFA, then I highly recommend you that you turn it off. Second thing is to download, deinstall it. If you, in case you deinstall it, then I highly recommend you to deinstall every single game that comes with it. Unless you want to deinstall it again, then this is very important. For me, I highly recommend you to use this one this software it is called uh wait for it, it opens there it is it is called your installer it helps a lot when it comes to the installing stuff it will literally disinstall and remove every single file that is located or related to this uh, application so click on here quick install and it will be quickly installed and removed from your pc of course there is the other normal method which is going to your control panel and from here in case you had it by category make sure to change it by category not uh, small icons or all large icons just go to category go to programs and from here install a program search for ea as you can see here it is click on and install and it will be installed make sure that it is closed to not cause you any problem make sure every game that is associated with it or any application like xbox or steam that are associated directly with ea are not open so you can delete it without any problems and yeah this is how you can delete your ea application it's very quick and easy very simple nothing will cause you harm and nothing will cause you any problems in the future if we did these methods that i have shown you the first one is highly recommended in case you would like to remove everything every file every cache file everything but the second is only to delete the software itself without any add-ons that it might be downloaded with it so thank you guys a lot for watching see you guys in the next video